hi welcome to kids lab today we are going to do one lab activity area and pedic meter for this we need pencil and crayons and we will draw this given below figures on this square paper so first of all draw rough sections on this pictures given below as you can see the figure a is a rectangle so draw the section accordingly here i have drawn with a 4 is to 2 section Draw the same section on the square paper. For figure B, it is a vertical rectangle. So here we will draw the section with 3 is to 4. And draw the same one on the square paper. draw 4 by 4 section on the square paper. In figure D, divide the rectangle into small squares. Draw the horizontal lines and the vertical lines till you get the small squares. Now draw the same figure on the square paper. Here all total 12 squares. Figure E is the irregular shape and divide this one each rectangle into two squares. First of all, make the placement and then draw. Next come to the figure F and draw here 3 squares vertically and 5 squares horizontally. As here it is written we need to color the area and perimeter with two different colors so let's take the dark color to color the perimeter means the boundary if you are new to my channel then do subscribe and press the bell icon for further notification some of these boundaries is called perimeter The space occupied by this figure is called area. Fill those area with the light and contrast color sketch paint. Here I have taken orange color to be the contrast of green color. Now to calculate the perimeter, we only need to add the sides. And to calculate the area, we need to calculate the number of squares. Let's find out the perimeter. For this, each square has the 1 cm as a side. Let's just count. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Write the perimeter with the help of the same sketch pen. Next, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. 
so its perimeter is 14 cm 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 21 22 23 24 25 26 27 28 29 30 so its perimeter is 30 cm next 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 its perimeter is 16 cm next 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 its one is 16 cm now count all the squares for the area so 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 it's 8 square centimeter figure b is having all total 12 squares and so area is 12 square centimeter let's count for figure c it's all square is 16 so the area is 16 square centimeter then figure e here all total number of squares is 14 so the area is 14 square centimeter for figure e sorry t it is all total 12 squares so 12 square centimeter so similarly you need to just count number of squares and you can write the area next write your name and your class thank you so much for your love and support Keep motivating me in this way. If you like this video, then don't forget to turn white thumb blue. And stay tuned for the next video. Bye-bye.